So you've been nominated for Best Podcast Producer for your podcast, Spoiler. Please tell me a little bit more about it. Um, Spoiler is a show where we, we review um, pretty much anything, books, TV shows, films, um, but we review the whole thing. And obviously the thing with podcasts is that people can choose to listen to it or not. So we make it very, very clear at the start, if you're listening to all of this, we're going to give away the ending, so watch it first. Um, so yeah, that, that was the idea behind it, that you know people can go and watch the film first then come and listen to what we thought of it. That's wonderful. Do you have like a storytelling technique to keep your listeners listening? Um, oh, I don't know. I mean, I'm very lucky to have a very good team with me. Um, the host is Paul Tyler and then there's uh, Rachel and Andy who um, work alongside him doing the, the reviews. Um, and then they also, every show we have features which are kind of related to the, the film in some way. So, for example... Um, we did a feature about the depiction of homosexuality in, in, film, in film when we reviewed Widnail and I, um, that kind of thing. And um, Andy and Rachel write all those features for me. Um, and then I kind of work on them to edit them and add music and sound effects and clips from films and that kind of thing. So, um, yeah, I don't know about my, my storytelling technique, but, um, yeah, yeah, it's all about kind of finding the right pieces of audio to, to kind of tell the story, I guess. That's fantastic. Is there a specific movie that you've enjoyed, or box set, or TV show that you've explored enjoying that really stands out to you? Um, oh wow! Um, we recently did um, the TV series Fleabag, which I loved. I thought it was great. You know, right from the very first episode, in fact, the first five minutes. You know, doing a new—it's a comedy series, and doing a new comedy is a really hard thing. The first episode is usually a little bit dodgy, and I tend to—I have a policy of watching at least the first two just to give it a chance. But Fleabag just hit the ground running and was brilliant from, from day one. So, uh, yeah, we reviewed that in, our, I think, our last series. And uh, the whole team loved it, pleased to say. Yeah. And there's 19 awards and, and tons of nominees. Is there anyone else who you hope, fingers crossed, that they will win an award tonight? Um, I don't know. I see that uh, Ed Miliband is, is uh, nominated. So I, I'd quite, I don't know if he's here, but uh, I'd like to see that, yeah. Wonderful. Thank you so much for talking to us and good luck. Thank you very much.